dare they say they're doing this for the planet? The others made it. Guess it's time to look for a new job. Wow, there's a bunch of people riding in the freight car. Guess they don't have much choice, but rather them than me. No thieves get my So cramped. Stop that so right now! Man, hey, everyone's on edge. Of course they are. Hey, Cloud. I am. Um, we were out on a If you're about to unburden yourself, don't. Yeesh! You don't make it easy. No thief skin my money. Should have gone to Sector 3 instead. Hey, got a second? My daughter now lives in Sector 8, so... You're, uh, holding up pretty well, huh? Even after what we saw at the station and all over have Sector 8? I'm a soldier. Yet? Well, my hands are still shaking. You get used to it. Something to look forward it's to. My daughter or now lives in maybe Sector not. Eight, so <sighs> just leave me alone, all right? <laughs> Little help, Cloud, please. I can't stop stupid. thinking about it. Yeah, the bomb I made shouldn't have produced an explosion too. that big. It doesn't make any sense. The explosion triggered a reaction with the Mako. You said so yourself. That was my first guess, but Good shouldn't the reactor have fail-safes to prevent that kind of thing? I'm sure Sector hmm. 7's affected too. You mentioned no, invisible sure enemies back there, happen. right? Right. Oh, no. I'm just looking for excuses for something that was clearly my own fault. <sighs> Gotta own up to it if I'm gonna learn from this and move on. Thanks, Cloud. You're a good listener. What kind of maniacs would go so far as to bomb a reactor? <sighs> They've yet to announce it publicly, but I heard it was Avalanche's doing. Really? Aren't they the terrorists who tried to kill the president? Is there nothing they won't do? Hey, <gasps> quit talking <gasps> out your ass. <gasps> Everyone knows Avalanche only cares about saving the planet. Just who do you think you are? A law-abiding concerned citizen. Law-abiding? Really? Mm. <laughs> uh, shh. Don't antagonize him. In my humble opinion, that explosion was a message. A message to the bastards bleeding our planet dry. Think they got it? Heard it loud and clear, y'all's masters. We will not submit to intimidation or violence, but work together for peace and prosperity. That is how civilized people change the world. That's right. That is the Shinra Creed. <laughs> Them spiking words. <laughs> it's what we believe. We all have to follow our conscience, don't we? We should go. Right. <laughs> How much longer till the station? Man, this train is slower than molasses, am I right? Oh. Dear. You hear that suit? Shouldn't recreate my ass. <sighs> Let's get this out of the way. Personally, I find visual aids make the dull stuff a lot more bearable. If it helps. Think of it as an initiation rite. How many times do I have to tell you people? I'm not... S There's such a thing as playing too hard to get. 
So, here we've got a wireframe model of the great city of Midgar, complete with massive steel plates suspended 300 meters above ground level. Atop which stands a shining beacon of civilization. The whole system is sustained by the Mako reactors, which feed the insatiable appetites of the public. The train will be passing through an ID checkpoint shortly. This here is the train's route. As you can see, it'll take us around this main pillar. Look, we're about halfway through it now. They've set up a checkpoint here to scan the IDs of all passengers heading in and out. Date of birth, residential status, criminal history, all that and more is automatically cross-referenced in their databases. Public security wouldn't have it any other way. Heads up. <coughs> Don't worry, our IDs are impeccable. What I tell ya? Have a little faith. Won't be long till we reach the bottom. Relax. Take a good look. It's because of that great big pizza in the sky that people down there got to struggle to survive. Shinra sucks up Mako. While the soil turns to dust, the air fills with smog, and the flowers die. Then leave and don't look back. <sighs> that's what's always worked for me. <sighs> well, that's all well and good. If you're only out for yourself. But the folks down there don't have the luxury of choice, you know? One, members lost zero. And one step closer to a brighter future. Hell yeah! Guys! Lower your voices, huh? People are listening. Oh, God. Right. <laughs> ah. hmm. Now get some r, r You've earned it. Just be ready for the next mission, all right? Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> See you soon. Uh, at Seventh Heaven. You know where Tifa works? Don't keep her waiting. She worry. Not long now. Office still sure there? You have now. My husband? How are people here taking it? Wow, my hunt. What are we even doing here? No one in their right mind would go into a train graveyard. At night. People talk, rumors spread, and kids get curious. You know how it is. Speaking of which, you hear it was supposedly a ghost, not a monster, that attacked that guy this afternoon? They must have been seeing things. <sighs> wow, am I hungry? Guess I'll stop by one of the food stalls. So, you hear that burger joint staying open tonight? No way! I'd kill for one right now. on the schedule first thing tomorrow morning. Thank you for your patience. When I put him in charge of my stand, I told him, son, 
The goal isn't to make a fortune, it's to make people happy. Sounds great. Well, but I think he's over by the TVs. Hmm? So the Mako reactor's broken? For now. But don't you worry. We're gonna fix it. It'll be up and running in no time. Really? That's great! Sure is, sweetie. I feel like it's been forever since I've eaten at one of these. Well, then you can fall in love with Pride Marsh all over again. Uh? Back down here? So, oh, I wish I could tell you, but sadly, I don't share your passion for processed food. Hmm. I am three sheets to the wind. Huh. I'm just the slums. There's trash everywhere and the smell. Shh. That's so loud. Can we even trust the hotels around here? I bet their mattresses are crawling with bugs. I've never felt the ground shake like that. And bombs a reactor. The kind of person who goes around putting up flyers all over the slums, I expect. That sounds true. Dumb Platy's only had it so good because of the reactors. And this bombing's changed all that. Yeah, well, shoes on the other foot now. Let's see how they like fighting to survive. They're people too, you know. Hmm. <laughs> Dumb Platy's only had it so good because of the reactor. I'd never seen anything like it before. It was completely insane. Security was out in full force looking for the bombers. I even saw a few helicopters. Wow, that sounds intense. It was like a giant candle lighting up the whole sky. Oh, the sector oh, up was like a nightmare. nightmare. You couldn't Fires nowhere. everywhere. I thought this is where I die. Mako is the lifeblood of the planet? Yeah, the hell it is. Goddamn eco-warriors with their dumbass posters. I tear them down and they're back up inside of an hour. Like I've got nothing better to do. I mean, look at all that steelwork. You trying to tell me that's not progress? <laughs> <laughs> Okay, buddy? <laughs> Mako Junkie, huh? Figures. You again. That hot shower can't come soon enough. I can barely tell my skin from all the ash and sweat. Warning. Gate broken. Fiends in area. Exercise caution. No reason to check it out. Not my problem. You don't want to mess with the monsters in here. Move along now. Public security should know who did it. So... So you'll interrupt them while they're working? Um, uh, excuse me? Uh, due to an emergency, entry into this area is prohibited. Sorry for the inconvenience. You call that a warning? No, sir! That's 
right, Angel? I Welcome am. back. <laughs> Have you been a good girl? Yeah, I have to come with Tifa. <laughs> oh, you did, did you? Well, well. <laughs> you made it. <laughs> Where'd you get that? I can't remember the last time I saw a real one. <laughs> huh? <sighs> How sweet. When did you get so thoughtful? A guy can change. It has been five years. Huh? I need to talk to Barrett. Right. Come on in. Daddy, the Mongo place blew up. Everyone on TV is talking about it. Don't you worry about all that silliness. Daddy's here and he's not going anywhere tonight. Now turn that thing off and let's get you to bed, huh? Uh. Hey! What uh, the hell do you think you're doing scaring my daughter like that? Daddy says never talk to strangers. <clears throat> That's right, honey. I do say that. What a good girl you are remembering daddy's lessons. <laughs> you know what else good girls do? They go to bed on time. Come on. I want to talk some more, Daddy. Mm, all right, but just this once. <sighs> uh, so then, what can I get you? My money. I'm still waiting on it. Uh, right. About that. We should talk outside. <sighs> um, Daddy? Did the people who died all return to the planet? Of course. Before we get on to money, there's an empty apartment in a place just down the road. It's nothing fancy, but I was thinking you could stay there for now. The landlady's a big friend of the cause, so you wouldn't even have to pay rent. Sound good? Sure does. Thanks. <laughs> Follow me then. How was it up on the plate? It was... chaotic. Sorry for dragging you into all this. It was wrong of me to put you in danger like that. I promise I won't do it again. Dangerous part of the job. Don't worry about me. I'll try not to. Always happy to help stick it to Shinra. Not good at all. So, you make nice with everyone? Much as I could, all things considered. Maybe not enough for them. Good. You had me worried. You're not exactly a people person. I'll give you that. I saw Sector 8 on the news. It was like a war zone. The news is just another Shinra mouthpiece. We'll spread whatever lies Shinra tells them to. So, it wasn't that bad? It was. Oh, right. And here we are, good old Stargazer Heights. You're on the second floor. Room 201 here is where I sleep. Don't have time for much else, what with Seventh Heaven and all. <laughs> Not even time to decorate. Here's your room, 202. Don't worry, I already told the landlady about you. You did? Yes? Oh, I mean, I told her I had a friend looking for a place to stay. Was that too much? No. It's fine. And this? That one's, uh... Know what? It's getting late. I'll introduce you tomorrow. It's a little bare but should be enough to get you through the night. If you want anything else, we can always there get it. There is one thing, my money. You guys owe me 2,000, remember? I do, and we'd love to settle up, especially since this was your first job for us, but... That's it? Sorry, we spent the rest preparing for the mission. That really is it. 
But not for long. I'm collecting money for filters tomorrow, so I can pay you after. <laughs> and you're sure about that? Of course. As long as you help, that is. Wait. Then I'd have to pay you for that, too. Never mind. No. Two thousand's enough. That's what we agreed on, so... That'll be the price. With what you gave me, that leaves fifteen hundred. You're the best! I'll see you bright and early at the bar, then. Thanks again for everything. Sleep tight. It's time for introductions. Hey, you okay in there? Oh. Coming in. But he's not a bad guy. The landlady asked me to check on him now and then to make sure he's okay. Can I ask you to do the same? Sure. Well now, you must be Cloud. I'm Marl, your landlady. So how'd you like the place? You from up on high? I've been around. I'll bet. No matter. All kinds come through with all kinds of reasons. If you ever need an ear to bend, I'll lend you mine. Can be about anything. Even Tifa. What's she to you? The granddaughter I never had. And if you hurt her, I'll take it out of your hide. You hear me? Loud and clear. Good. Cool. Now you'd best get a move on to Seventh Heaven. She's got a head start on you and then some.
It was just one reactor, dear. Everyone I know said they felt a lot better after talking to Marl about their problems. The Watch is saying they're gonna step up their game. How? Until they get Reactor 1 back Searching up for candidates. The trains don't start moving Searching again. for candidates. Gotta admit, the one was a couple of years back. Probably. Until they get Searching for one candidates. That new wedge mentioned? The merchant? What? That sword's massive. What does he sell again? Don't want to get hurt, keep your distance. Warning. Gate broken. No reason to check it out. Not my problem. That sword's massive. What is Searching for candidates. The folks who are tops out are losing pay by the day. Even our facilities are starting to look a little run down. Don't you think? Everybody does. We keep putting off maintenance. Yeah. We gotta do something about the monsters on the <sighs> Tell me you're making that face because you think it looks cool. We gotta do something about the monsters on Scrap Boulevard. I'll head on down there first thing. Even our facilities are starting to look a little run down. The guy who lives over there's got a real hard on for cleanliness. Shoot this one out once before. He was really upset about the trash thing. What's the big sword for? Not a lot of options when it comes to food. Just imagine if rich people start on the plate. Enough of them move down here. There's chili beans! Another way to get a win place in the tip. If you're interested in seeing Loveless, I could offer it. Who the hell know? The vacant lot up ahead is overrun with wild beasts. Even if you are, be careful. Check it out. This song's pretty sweet, ain't it? You like it? You feeling it? Have a copy. Come on. Something Danger. Not going that way. that friend of Tifa's I've heard so much about. The mercenary? I've got fingers in a few pies myself. Work with a lot of businesses. Even Seventh Heaven, on occasion. <laughs> what I'm saying is, you and me, we're not so different. And certainly not complete strangers. In fact, I want you to think of me as family. You know, an uncle or maybe a distant relative. It's times like this that remind you how inconvenient life is now. Mm -hmm. I've chatted with that Barrett guy a few times. He looks like a real hard ass, but he's actually pretty chill. Morning. Hey. Just so you know, 
Marlene's still asleep. <sighs> Let's get down to business, shall we? Huh? These water filters won't replace themselves. <laughs> Although the next batch probably could, if Jessie put her mind to it. <sighs> Most every home in the area has one. Folks love them because they practically eliminate the rotten egg smell. Honestly, they make us more money than this place. And it's easy money, too. We bring new filters, collect the old ones, and get paid. What? <sighs> Give me a break. I'm not a salesman. I'm a soldier. Which is why no one will refuse to pay. What do you say? <sighs> Please? <sighs> Let's get this over with. Great. And while we're at it, I'll give you the grand tour. Go ahead and keep whatever we collect. Seeing as you didn't bring any luggage, I'm guessing there's stuff you need to buy. Thanks. And don't worry. We'll pay you the difference after. Barrett's out making his own As long as I get it all today. All the items you can want, straight from the plate. No matter your needs or your budget. Or hey there. Here to change out your water filter. Tifa, baby, how you doing? Been waiting for you to... Wait, let me see. Cloud's in charge of collections. He'll take your money. Sounds like a pretty sweet gig. If you ever need someone to fill in, I'm your man. In your dreams, maybe. Huh? Cloud? Uh... Since we're here, maybe we should do a little shopping. Suppose I could take a look. Nothing to tickle your fancy. If you change your mind, you know where I am. That goes for you too, Tifa. We'll see you around, okay? And let us know when your filter next needs changing. Mm -hmm. All the items you can want. He's a regular. Stock up here and he might throw in a freebie or two. For you, maybe. Well, you could try being a little nicer. To get free shit? Not my style. <laughs> Our next stop is Stargazer Heights. Landlady's a client. Just met her. Then you know what to expect. Remember, she's a good friend of Avalanche, so be nice. Please? Can't help but take a little pleasure in their panic. More than a little. My husband decided to go to the station and see if it had gotten any better. Nothing to report. Maintaining surveillance. Hey, Marl. Got some filters for you. Tifa, my dear, dear girl. Oh, what's he doing here? Working? Be nice. <laughs> Cloud's helping me with collections. You better take care of her. I'm pretty good at taking care of myself, you know. That I do. Still, better him than you. No charm, no wit, big sword, but no skills. I've got skills. Be nice. I'm doing my best. You're looking awfully glum. Are you getting enough sleep? A good long rest to cure anything, I tell you. A tried and true lesson for life on the ground floor, am I right? That you are. Now, your money. Thanks, Marl. You take care of yourself. Don't do anything I wouldn't do.
Don't you still have work to do? Well, go on then. Get back to it. Marl's great. She helped get me set up back in the day. You been here a while now? Five years, give or take. Uh, but never mind that. We've got to get you your money. Last stop is the weapons drawer. Don't try anything. Hey, if it isn't Tifa. <laughs> hey! That last filter didn't do shit! We're so sorry about that. Hopefully this one will work better. Save your excuses and get out! All right. If you could just settle your bill, we'll be on our way. The hell? You charging me for your busted ass goods? My associate handles payment disputes. Think you can mosey up in here and have it your way? Pretty please. <laughs> Thank you very much. Seeing as we're done with our rounds and you've got a small fortune now, why not take a gander at the weapons? Well, when will Barrett be back with the rest? Before we open up tonight. It'll be a while yet, so... What do you want to do? Don't really know. In that case, I've got a suggestion. Want to hear it? If you're serious about becoming a merc, then you're going to need to start making connections. It's not what you know, but who you know, you know? Hmm. Another lesson for life on the ground floor. Yep. Connections get you jobs. Jobs build your rep. And more rep gets you better connections. How do I start? Hmm. Why not help out the Neighborhood Watch? They're mostly volunteers, but you'll get to know people. Yeah, okay. Didn't see anybody at the office, so let's head up top. No better way to keep you and your family safe than with a weapon of your own. Huh? Come and check out I ain't got nothing for a punk-ass bitch like you. Get on out of here. For you and your needs. Huh? I ain't got nothing for a punk ass. No bitch. better way to keep you and your family safe than with a weapon of your own. Come and check out our selection. Speak with our friendly staff. We gotta do something about the monsters on Scrap Boulevard. I'll head on down there first thing tomorrow. Not alone, you won't. Huh? Didn't know you were holding down the fort. Huh? Oh, uh, hey, Cloud. Looking to join the neighborhood watch? That depends. What does this neighborhood watch do? Uh, lots of stuff, really. But our top priority is taking care of any beasts that wander into town. That, and teaching the locals how to defend themselves. Like they say, the only one who will look out for you is you. Cloud's a great fighter, but only we know that. If no one knows him, no one will hire him. Thought if he joined the Watch, he could get his name out there. That would work for everybody. Truth be told, we could really use your help. We can't pay you in kill, but we'll work something out. For example, aha, uh -huh. what about your sword? I could mod it for you. No thanks. It's fine just the way it is. What, you some kind of purist? I know I'd never pass up a chance to improve my gear. Come on, at least let me show you how it's done.
All set? Needless to say, you'll have to try it out to appreciate the difference. Thanks. <laughs> we'll do you one better. Spread the word to everyone who'll listen about the new Mercantown. Between him and Wedge, there isn't anyone they don't know. I'll march through the streets singing your praises, even on an empty stomach. So, where are these monsters? Scrap Boulevard. Good hunting. Hey, Cloud, I'll come with. No, I've got this. But you don't know the way, do you? We don't. <laughs> sure thing. I know these streets better than anyone. Working for the Neighborhood Watch is the best kind of cover. This isn't just a cover. We really do want to keep the neighborhood safe. We grew up here after all. Scrap Boulevard, Boulevard is out west. Past the barricades, supposed to keep the monsters out. Anyway, we should prepare, just in case. Someone looks like they're having a bad day. Try getting them. We gotta do something about the monsters on Scrap Boulevard. Even our facilities are starting to look a little better. Searching for candidates. Is that who Wedge mentioned? That sword's massive. Good luck, Tifa, and be careful. Here's Scrap Boulevard. I can see why monsters are feeling right at home. And the more we pile up, the more they show up. Soldier looks like an action. This was just a warm up. <laughs> I'll bet. Let's keep at it. Ha! No holding back. That's that. in like it was nothing you too it's a little surprising well i've been here five years now if you don't look out for yourself no one else will by the way that one's gonna be on the test is this a lesson you gotta learn yeah. you're gonna stick around yeah. okay. let's do this yeah. See ya. I think that might be the last of them. They won't stay gone for long. Of course not. Even so, folks will be grateful for the peace and quiet in the meantime. A win's a win, you know? True. Trust me, it'll do wonders for your rep. Right. Let's go check in with Biggs and Wedge. <laughs>
looks massive. What is he searching for candidates? I hear you sell so Tally of Monster Slain has been updated. Got new numbers for Monster Slain this month. Check them out. Back already? Got every last one, too. Now the slum should be safe. You guys are machines! Good job. Meanwhile, we told everyone we could about you. So I heard. I've got to ask, though. What did you tell them? It's all right. All you got to do is keep up the good work. It'll pay off soon enough, I promise. How's the sword, by the way? Good. Glad to hear it. Seems like the perfect fit for you. Yeah. We've been through a lot. Oh. You okay? I'm fine. Been meaning to ask. After you left the village... It's a long story. I've got time. Why don't you tell me all about it while we try to wrestle up some more work for you? That sounds great! I'll come too! Oh, uh, no you won't. What? Run along now, you two. Uh, Sorry, go on. maybe uh. next time. Huh? No fair! Uh, think about it for a second. They haven't seen each other in years. You'd be a third wheel. Uh, uh. Hey, before we get back to it, why don't you check out the weapons? No need. Come on, the dealer's probably heard all about you by now. Might treat you better. I don't know about that. You hear someone got rid of all the monsters on Strap Boulevard? Oh, you know, there's a the people there. That's that mercenary guy. Doesn't look that strong. Hold up. Heard there's a merc that'll take on any monster. You the man? Word spreads fast around here. What if I am? Sorry about before. I get antsy when business is slow. That man in your line of work needs weapons, no? Why not try that one on for size? Yours on the house. Badass like you rocking my weapons is good advertising. Think about it. Fine. Or if you want to take a look at something else. Just a look. Don't be a stranger. Since you've got yourself a new weapon, let's see if we can't put it to good use. Come on, let's go chat up Weimer. Who? The guy who tracks all the requests that come to the watch. You never know. Could toss some work your way. Where's he at? Oh, he should be back at the office by now. Uh. You're the aspiring odd job. Charlie, right? a monster slain has been updated. Searching for Got candidates. Got new numbers for monster slain this month. Check them out. Oh, hey there, Chiefa. You need a helping hand? Actually, I wanted to introduce you to an old friend of mine. This is Cloud. He's a merc. Ah, you don't say. Well, we're always on the lookout for experienced fighters to help us deal with the bigger critters. I'll take on anything. For the right price, that is. Experienced and cocky, huh? If it's a challenge you want, I might have a few good ones. Your clients can fill you in on the details. Prove yourself with these jobs, and I'll see if I can't find you some more. Thanks.
Candidate detected. Performing physical analysis. Sizable weapon. Excellent cardiovascular health and impressive lung capacity. Perfectly balanced muscle and bone structure. An optimal candidate. My name is Chadley. I'm an intern for Shinra's Research and Development Division. I hope you'll be interested in helping me with my research. Please accept this as a down payment. I would like you to set that assessed materia in your equipment and use it to gather intelligence in battle. This data will help me to develop new types of materia. I'm not interested in working for Shinra. You should know that I work actively to undermine Shinra's efforts. I'm sure you of all people can appreciate the tremendous power of materia as well as how it might be wielded against your corporate enemies. And if you later decide that I am not worthy of your trust, you can do what you do best. I will hold you to that. Excellent! Then we shall work together so long as you deem fit. Once you've completed your task, please return and report to me. You'll never want for work around here if you prove yourself useful. Please set the orb of assessed materia to your equipment and use it to gather battle lead. Here are go-to monsters. Virgin cleaned up scrap boulevard. Nice job, uh. buddy. Don't screw this up. Don't hold back. You got it. I got your number. is there. Piece of cake. Nothing to it. This won't take long. Not at all. Allow me. Get ready. Swap it. See ya. That's the way. 
way to do there. it. That should be enough intel for the kid. Cloud! You were the first to gather the data I requested. Here is the rest of your payment. I have developed new materia. Would you like to see it? I plan to develop more materia in the future. Together, we can harness enough power to take down Shinra. I'll keep repairing more battle intel reports, which I hope you will assist me in completing. That went well. Could be you found your calling. Eh, uh, was all right, I guess. Think of each job as an opportunity, not to make money, but to build connections. It's not what you know, but who. <laughs> you remembered. Not a patient teacher. <laughs> Maybe not so patient next time. Oh boy. <laughs> oh, Barrett should have finished collecting his share of the money by now. So what do you want to do? Head back to the bar? Tifa, welcome back! And you, the new Mercantown looking for work, right? Yeah. In that case, maybe you could do something about the Doom Rats? Them and their were rat buddies have been tearing up town, looking for food and whatnot. Got into the store and made one hell of a mess, let me tell you. <laughs> oh, you think that's funny, do you? Don't lie, I saw you crack a smile. Well, do the job and you can laugh it up for all I care. Anyway, they're probably nesting in the outskirts. Now I've heard a were rat in pain will call its friends for help. And the whole rat pack will come running just like that. Figure the pack must be nesting somewhere just outside of town. You a lover? You a fighter? Just imagine if rich people. You got anything and everything you could possibly need. about you. A friend of mine is a fighter. Actor. Seriously. See any doom rats around? Hmm. What do you think? Should we wait? You know, this might be a waste of time. Let's head back to the store and touch base for now. Snips the bloodless 
something creepy. All the items you could want, straight from the blink. No matter your needs or your budget. Well, rats too much to handle? I'm just messing with you. Heard you took out some wear rats, which is nice and all, but the job was to wipe up the doom rats. No big. Get back out there and finish the job, and we're good. Don't look so glum. It's only a matter of time till they show. You'll get them this time for sure. All the items you can want, straight from the another day. A friend of mine, an aspiring actor. those gloves up sure thing coach straight from the plate no matter your needs or your budget or what finally managed to get those doom rats huh thanks guys you're the greatest I was so dead in here I thought I might have to close up shop for good hey got an idea hear me out if the guy who took care of the town's rat problem told everybody where he liked to shop well, what do you say? I'll make it worth your while, of course. Give you some incentive. Talk you up to Weimer and my customers, and anybody else who listen. You'll be swimming in work before you know it. Yeah, sure. <laughs> okay, then. That's what I like to hear. Seventh Heaven, the new Merc in town in my little store. I can see it now. We're gonna clean up. here to shop are you people were right you look like you can handle yourself so some drakes have made themselves at home in the abandoned Talliger factory can't have that kind of trouble around here my regulars will do anything to get their hands on the scrap in there and if they run into those drakes they could get hurt I'll handle it much obliged sir head on over to the old Talliger factory and talk to Narjan he's the watchman guarding the entrance good luck I'm counting on you, my friend. Never ask folks about their suppliers. They don't take kind of questions. So I was at the hundred. Something's wrong. Let's check it out. Stay away from me! Hold it! <laughs> Settle down now. Get off me, assholes! I didn't do shit! Shut up, punk! Or what, huh? Screw you! What's going on? Why are you Somebody gonna do me like went that? and stole some blast grenades from a Shinra warehouse. So public security started asking questions, and you know how Johnny gets. It's because of the reactor bombing, I bet. I could be wrong, but something tells me. They're not gonna settle for just roughing him up this time. We've gotta save him, Cloud. Is he Avalanche? No. He doesn't really know what we do. But he has his suspicions. And... He's a talker. 
Actually, you know what? Maybe I should go alone. I'm coming. Uh, are you sure? It's the least I can do. Lead on. <sighs> Thanks. Come on. Citizens don't steal blasting agent. So why don't you tell me why your ID popped when we were going over the warehouse logs? Huh? You got it all wrong. You haven't brought anywhere near a Shinra warehouse. That's my ID. <laughs> your ID was never lost, young man. It never got you inside a Shinra installation. I swear. All he had to do was keep his mouth shut. Yep. Anyway, you distract the officers and I'll figure something out. Let him go. Hmm? Who are you? The cavalry? Huh? Is that, is that who I think it is? Oh, hell yeah! You guys really came to save me! Ow! Oh, oh. Hey! What do you think you're doing? Here we go. <laughs> Let's do this. It's over. <laughs> Alright. Grenade out! See ya. <laughs> He's a talker. Huh? Whoa! Whoa! No! Huh? You're not gonna hold up! Wait! Don't! Don't do it, man! You wanna live? Then get the hell out of town. <laughs> you, you got it, boss. You ain't never gonna see my face again. I swear! <laughs> Are you sure about this? It's a big risk. I know, but it's fine. And them? No more. Cloud, you're scaring me. <laughs> we need to go before they wake up. I... I'm worried about Johnny. I'm more worried about us. We gotta go, right? Right. What? It's just... You've really changed. How? I suppose it's... Yeah. Your eyes. They used to be less... It's the Mako. Soldier, remember? I remember. So, what do you want to do now? Head back to the bar, or do you want to tackle another job or two?
leaving town. My boy up and declared he was leaving town to go on a journey. <laughs> we only live once. I say while he's young, he should follow his heart, even if it means defying the man. Playing by the rules only gets you so far. I wonder what's going on. My sister, on the, they were saying, please. A lot more people. If the planet's a living being, we should be learning more about it. There are monsters on the plate too, right? Nope. That's not hey, fair. The factory's off limit. Factory's off limits. Drakes have been spotted inside. Huh? Wait a minute. Tifa? Don't tell me you're here to take care of those things. Are you? In that case, be my guest. We believe there's at least two groups lurking somewhere inside the factory. Find and cull them all. Don't hold back. You got it. Let's do this. That's that. Get ready. It's over. I see you. Let's end this quick. Not a problem. Best thing right. Those gloves up. Sure thing, coach. You're dead. Get ready. It's over. <laughs> Brace yourself. 
You're good at this. <laughs> Told you so. Won't be tough. Good at this. <laughs> Told you so. Locked up tight. Won't be tough. Of course not. Give them hell. The factory's open for business again. If the planet's a living being, we should. I think we all know that. Maybe we never should. Sure so this is all. My sister on the way. Way. I saw Johnny fly out of yes. his place like a rocket. He said he was leaving town. Those disgusting vermin deserved what they got rid of those drakes in the factory, did you? What a relief. I can't wait to give my regulars the good news. You're the real deal, all right. Keep it up, and I can see you going far as a merc in this town. I've worked with my fair share over the years, so believe me when I say that I know what I'm talking about. Anyway, you're needed over at the pillar. Apparently another flying bastard stirring up trouble. Bet you can't get enough of this, huh? Well... No, I get it. If you're good at something, 
might as well make it your living. May not know you, but I know a man who's found his calling when I see one. Keep at it. I switch out my stock every so often, so drop by when you're in the neighborhood, huh? Welcome! I'm always getting in new stuff to keep up with the latest trends. You won't be disappointed. Always a pleasure. Oh, if you're planning to, might want to buy some extra supplies first. Hey, this look for those disgusting vermin deserve. she could help me find my friends. I know someone who can help you. This guy right here. Really? Okay, let me tell you all about them. They have long arms and legs, and they're a little skinny. They like places where there's food. And nice people will give them treats when they ask. And small spaces. Oh yeah, and they're all cats. I'm looking for cats. They're friendly, so if you call them, they'll come running. All three of them. By my friends, please. <laughs> What's the source of all life? Uh -oh. Best of luck to you, kid. There's this one dude in the bottom. Yeah. Cerulean Drake flew in from the train graveyard, but these two clowns refused to get off their butts and do anything about it! Hey, is that...? It is you, the new Merc! Then maybe you can help us out! The Drake is in the old telegraph factory over there, but to reach it, you'll need to get a hold of a watch security key. You should be able to find one inside one of the crates. I forget which, just smash them all. I'm looking for it has to be somewhere in the train. That mercenary, no. Sneak in and the watch will be mad at you. Recently, a rather a If it ain't the merc himself. This won't take long. Not at all.
Let's end this quick. Not a Come on. Let's do this. Nothing to it. Let's end this quick. Not a problem. Time to burn. Gloves up. Sure thing, coach. Damn it.
This won't take long. Not at all. Don't hold back. You got it. No holding back. That'll do. You need a light? Yes. No escape. You're good at this. <laughs> Told you so. the key? Yeah. Let's end this quick. Not a problem. <laughs> Calling fire. <laughs> Let's do this. <laughs> no holding back. Try this. That's the way to do it. I got your number. Just like that, okay? I got gotcha. you.
And there he is! I knew you were the right man for the job. There's no denying you're the real deal. Not like these idiots with their excuses. Rather have one of you than 20 of them. They're just doing their jobs. Can't expect them to be at your beck and call. What exactly is it you're trying to say, Merc? You need people who can follow orders, too. I see now. Heard you were ex-Shinra. Guess I shouldn't be surprised you'd go to bat for your old buddies. Me? I'm just looking out for my people. All there is to it. Hell with you. We can take care of this town ourselves. No more Mercs or Shinra. We'll build up the watch and kick you all out. I'll bet a lot of people are talking about you right now. There's this amazing Merc who can handle anything. Nothing I've done around here has been all that special, though. Oh, so you want more of a challenge, huh? about you? I think the we best thing to do is Maybe we never should. Please give me a job. You can't hide forever after you The bomber that's locked over that to rock. And maybe what's going on? What's that? I need a job. You won't get the Wait, did you hear that just now? I think what have been... Something to say? What they love crowded places, like the road to the station. It's a lot. Like I'll turn on the TV. I swear, all the plates are just. That's where the watch guy bids live. There's a mine. Probably a monster hey, plane. Hey, got another job updated. for you, Merc. Got new numbers for monster. Check him out. A certain shopkeeper told me you paid him a visit. Thanks for helping him out. Just so happens there's another job I'd like to offer you. Now that I know you can handle yourself in a fight, you've got a real killer on the loose, you see. A rabid catch dog. Maybe you've heard people talking about it. Shinra Muck gone feral. Last sighting was in Scrap Boulevard. Think you're up to it? I'll handle it. You're a lifesaver. Doubt anyone else around here stands a chance. Go get him, bud. Is there anyone who can chase off that some of the dog is pounding the whole heart? Don't get yourself hurt. Coming through. Out of our way. No holding back. Shit. Here it comes. That's it. Let's do this. Try me. Here we 
go. Shit. Gotcha. Damn it. Sure you're ready. Gotta make a stand. Good at this. <laughs> Told you so.
Stay alert now. Took care of the dog, did you? Phew. We owe you one. Gotta say, I've never seen a Shinra breed like that before. Out of curiosity, when exactly did it show up? Oh, today. The first reports came in just this morning. Uh, why do you ask? Wait a minute. There's this crazy story about a Shinra research lab hidden right beneath our feet under the slums. Huh. Really? That's news to me. <laughs> and here I thought you might know something I don't. Well, I guess not. It's a big organization. I'm sure there's lots of secrets I don't know. Yeah, fair enough. You got the bastard. That's good enough for me.